You want to come to Mexico because this place is incredible, Puerto Vallarta, and it's one of the only places that accepts USA citizens. So, hmm. So I came to finish my book and swim in the ocean. Look, I live by the river, and I've been wanting to show you because what a cool spot this is. The birds are singing in the morning. There's bougainvillea on my patio. I'm really liking the tropics here, and the food, of course, amazing. Wow. So. Wow. So my book just came out last week, Around the World, What I Learned from 11 Years of Solo Travel, and um, it's on Amazon right now. Number four in photo essays, bestsellers. Very excited. But you know what I was thinking? I wanted to give you a tip. One of the most important things when you go to a new country, especially when it's a third and fourth world country, well, I guess this is more like a second world country, but watch where you're going on the sidewalk. Whoa. You can be looking around and step in a pothole. I've done it. I did it in India and I fell down. Not a good look. <laughs> and then I couldn't walk for two weeks. Thank goodness the day before I got to photograph the Dalai Lama and people said it was auspicious that I fell down when he was teaching. I didn't think it was so great. Anyway, look at how beautiful this is by the river. I'm, I'm loving this spot. So I haven't left in six weeks. And, uh, you know, it isn't perfect. <laughs> there is noise, but... To continue with solo travel tips, I wanted to share with you. Look at this gigantic tree, oh my God. I didn't even realize how big it was. Um, really pay attention. You're by yourself, especially if you're by yourself. And look around, don't get trashed. I have not hardly been drinking. Um, because you don't want to miss a step, fall down, not notice who's around. Things like that. So to stay safe, notice where you are at all time. And always stay somewhere where you feel safe. If there's any kind of question, don't stay there. So that's another reason I've stayed in this hotel, because I know the whole staff now. We're doing intercambio. They're learning English. I'm learning Spanish. It's been really fun. And um, they even let me use the kitchen. I like my patio. So it really helps to be in a neighborhood that you like and you feel safe in and ask the locals about it because they'll tell you. So tips for the day in three minutes or less and check out my book. You get a free sample when you go to Amazon, see what it's like for yourself. I got an amazing review today that made me cry. Um, feeling really good, love from Mexico.